So how you doing my fellow DJs? Uh, I don't know, I've been having problems with this damn recorder. It's just been stopping on its own, I don't know why. But uh, let's do this recording again. All right, chicken noodle soup. Switch that, do another video there. Now these are regular songs, these are regular MP3s. These are not songs with uh, video songs. Um, and as you can see, every time I throw a song, it'll bring up an effect, uh, a video effect. So I downloaded loops, I got loops. Uh, I'm able to use them with a regular song. I don't have to throw the song and the loop itself. It already select from a folder randomly. Let me show you how I did that. I go to settings, I, you go to video, You go to video, you scroll all the way down past, and here which says deck one and deck two. I only use two decks. I'm assuming if I have four, it'll show a four, but two select in a specific folder and display randomly. I created a folder, I named it DJ Music Video one, two, uh, logo video. So, uh, I have logo videos, I have regular uh, DJ VJ videos, you know, loops. Uh, try to get them short and I it just selects randomly from there if you have a radio song or a video song that you're playing it won't play the loops from these folders it will just play the song the video itself now another thing you must understand any videos you download cannot be 4k uh, it'll if you try to jump around on the 4k video it'll mess up It'll give you problems. I already experienced it. For you to avoid that, just don't. If you, I don't know what you're using to get your videos or how you're getting your video. If you're creating it yourself, don't create a 4K video. You're gonna have problems. 1080p is the maximum. Bitrate eight. Don't do it over an hour. Less than an hour. Actually, for the video loops and stuff like that, your songs are not an hour. So your songs are maybe uh, three minutes three minutes and a half. That's how long your video should be. Three minutes, three minutes and a half, the longest. That's it, because the video loops back to itself. So that as long as the song is playing, the video will continue play. Um, and again, the best, this works perfect because I'm right now VJing, video DJing, and I had to set this up and figure it out myself. So hopefully, this will help you out. Now, if you're having problems, if your videos are freezing for any reason, this might help. One, depending on the computer you have, how old is it, you know, what type of memory is it using, how much memory of video RAM you have. But if it's probably practically almost new, let's say you got four, six, eight gigs of DDR4 video RAM, you should be good. If you're having problems, go to your settings first. So for instance, I'm gonna to go to my video settings. Remember, there's two video cards, usually in the laptop. If you have, like me, that I have uh, a, a video card that came uh, a, attached to this in, internally with a CPU. So my CPU has its own video card, and then I have another video card inside of there, which is a standalone video card, which is the NVIDIA. So you can see here, integrated graphics, and then a high performance NVIDIA. I have two. I had selected, I had set it up to only use NVIDIA, but it's it was giving, it was giving me problems with record box. So I set it up in auto, and it resolved my problem. That's the same thing you should do. If you're having problems, check there and see if you could set it on auto. Again, it worked for me. Um, record box is working and to show you that it is working uh, Spanish electronic dance room uh, I'm trying to do oh these are mine from YouTube so it doesn't matter I created the animation as you can see this is 28 minutes half an hour I could jump around no problem um, I'm gonna hit play you're just not hearing the music because yeah, I don't want copyright issues and whatnot. Uh, it's it's plain. Video's playing nice and smooth. 
the animation is rolling text all of this animation I created myself so it works you know record box video does work and it does work well now I don't have it also at the highest setting because it was giving me a little ish bit of issue at the highest so I kept it a medium and medium works perfectly well you see it's running and the logo all this for YouTube so you know if you have any questions you could text me and I'll uh, uh, make a video or explain it to you or you know it's easy to do it's not complicated uh, you create a folder somewhere you go into uh, you create a folder so let me show you I have created a folder in my F drive since I have two hard drives in there I got my C my regular drive and I got an F drive for my music in my folder and this is where my VJ and logo and all that animation is located that's the folder I declared and that's where it's gonna search for music it also has samples um, but I, I really don't know where it's gonna load the samples from. but I could download the sample I can make oh here it is visual samples so it's downloaded as a zip drive right you know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that those samples that they have and you can see it's just four samples they're not even big kilobyte samples sphere tunnel parallel planet sphere so I highlight I'm just gonna cut right I'm gonna go to my drive I'm gonna go to my F drive music folder and here it is and all of these effects that I have there and I'll paste these in there it's moving it over it's done if I want to play it I hit play and you can see how quick it is so it's very short they're not like long effects, they're not. But they're gonna loop. So you can create, you can get a lot of effects and loop it. I got all these effects, some I created myself. So, let's see, uh, I think it'll play that. You can see, created it, bam. You're able to play it, use it, you know, it works. It just works. Polygon, Sphere, Sphere, blah, 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 blah. These I created myself. These are me. These are 730. So you see how it blinks. So if you want to create something like that, or something like this, this is all done on Filmora. That's what I use. Not the Pro, just the regular Filmora software. So this is created by me. You know. And, and it'll show up. You're able to do the same thing. These are not very long video, as you can see. I think the longest one is this one. I created that. I had another one that should have been. I can't remember the last one, but there's another one that I, that I had. I don't even put effect. Those are my old ones. So it's just five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten, what if I'm wrong? So this I created. This makes me see. Same thing. Created all that. Let my 
situation. Um, you're able to do the same thing. And this is like, hey, that's a normal than usual, but hey, it's just gonna loop itself, you know, until the song is over. So, um, that's it for now. Hopefully this will help you out. I'm trying to mess with the with the slideshow portion. You're able to use the text. So the text worked also. So, you know. All of this, it, it, it works. You know, record box, once you, the, the video portion of it, it's nice to have, it's nice to use. And it's nice to work with. I was lucky that I purchased everything on, you know, before they decided to go and make you pay your monthly bill. But if you have it, now you know that it works and you can use it. You know, and as you can see, no problems jumping around. It's, uh, The software that um, that works. People being entertained. Where I go and DJ, you can do the same thing. So let me let you go there. DJ Seven Thirty signing out. Hope you enjoyed. Peace.